Are you bored from having a little amount of gold? Well, in this video I will show you how to make an advanced AFK grinder. Also, this grinder gives gold blocks and it works as an underground grinder, which is an unbreakable grinder. So let's get right into it. First of all, if you don't know or never had an AFK grinder, then I recommend you to watch this video. The link will be around the description before this one. And let's get started. So first of all, click the hammer and then make sure you're on the plus sign and make sure you have anchor block turn it off. After you do that, tilt it once, place three after each other like this and then place ten of them on top of each other. After you do that, you can remove these, they are useless. And now you can make a little platform in here. The size doesn't matter, you just need to make like a little platform. After you make that platform, place a wooden block at the front and then you can start making the shape. So I'm going to speed this up and I'll be right back. Okay, after you did the shape, take the scale tool and then make the scale at 498 and then select any part and scale upward. You have to do this for every single part. So I'll speed this up and I'll be right back. As you guys can see, I just made this one and you just have to repeat this to every single part. Also to make sure you got the scale right, just look at this part, if it says 500 then it's, it's the right one. Okay, so now you have to place a seat right in the front right there and then take any jetpack even if it has limits, just take anyone and fly upward. After you're on the top, place a portal right in there and color it any color you want. So I'll color it red. Now you can place another one right in here and color it red again. Actually, I'm going to move it to here and go inside. Now I want you to place a seed at the end of this thing, right in here. Now you can save it, and now it's time for the duplication. You have to duplicate this thing five and a half times. If you don't know what I mean, you just can duplicate it five times, and then I'll tell you what to do after that. Also, if you don't know what duplication is, uh, there is a video right in the description. You can check it out and come back to this video. So you sit in this seat, take a cake and place it at the back and now take a balloon and place it in the front following with a hang. After you do that you can remove the balloon and the seat and the block underneath and fly to the stages. After you're in the first stage you go to the menu and load it again. And you have to drive this again to the... So after you're in the plot, you can remove the hang. 
and now you have to go inside the red portal just go inside and try to sit in the seat that you placed okay if you fail don't worry you can just go back to the portal and do it again Okay, so after you sit, you can remove the portal and place some blocks there just to attach it. So I'm going to use the Tamium rods. I'm going to place one in here and one in here. You don't have to place as much as me. You just have to place one and that's it. After you do that, you can remove the cake and the seat and you can save it again and repeat that process. So I'll speed this up and I'll be right back. So I duplicated it five times. Now it's time for the hat. So we just make a fly glitch, any normal fly glitch. Just sit, place a balloon in the front, and then a hang on top of it. After you do that, you can just remove these, or you can place a cake, and you can use a, a jet if you want. I'm just gonna use a jet, so we can fly faster. So fly up till you uh, pass four of these because we only want to duplicate four of these. So this is the third one and here's the fourth one. So after you get to here you can remove these. After you disconnected it you can just remove the fly glitch and go duplicate it just like normal. Okay, so after you did all of that, take a jetpack and fly as high as you can, which is which is 500 block. After you reach that limit that you have, uh, place a block, and then you place two blocks inside like that, and take a portal, rotate it once, place it like that, and now you can color it any color you want. I'm going to color it white, and I can remove this. And now I want you to make a fly glitch. Just make the fly glitch again with the jet at the back and fly to the top of this thing. Then your jet runs out. Just you can delete it. It's not needed anymore. The cake as well. Just go the just go to the grinder. And in here I want you to place two blocks just like that and place a portal on top of it. Make place a tilted portal on top of it like that. And make sure it has um, a different color. So, like, I'm going to use black for this tutorial. Also, the block that you place it, make sure they are not inward. Make sure they are outward. So, like, not inside from here. You can place it from here. So, I'll just make a wall in here. So, like, you don't pass the portal. You go inside the portal. So, just do any type of wall. So after you place the wall, you can save it and fly upward again. Okay, so after you're here, place a portal right in the edge and color it red. After you place the portal, get up and place any block and scale it and make sure the number is 17. So like, scale it uh, right there. After that, place any block. I'm going to use this block. You can remove the thing up on top of it and you can go and jump on it. Just like that. After you do that, place 12 pistons right here. After you do that, you can place a button right in the top. 
and now you can make some type of box right in here we just make this to the left and the right and place a portal at the bottom just like this and make sure that the color of this portal is the same of that portal so that was that one was black so i'm going to make this black and i'm going to match the box as this one after you do this scale it to the border so just scale it as long as you can after that you can place a portal here so like if you don't get the chest you just die uh, it's, it's not important but i recommend you to do it you just place a portal in the middle and color it any color so i'm going to use green after that you can save it one more time after all of that it's time to make the spawn funnel so for the spawn funnel just place any block and make sure you do it from the middle like place a block and then choose any block you have and scale make sure it matches the so as you see make sure it matches the size of the spawn i'm just gonna make it extra large like that and scale it upward it doesn't have to be as big as mine but mine will do the job so after you do that place a portal right at the edge and the color of the portal must be the same color of the portal that is like there so mine was white so i'm going to color it white and then take a block make the rotation 45 rotate twice and then make the rotation 15 and tilt it only once place it and scale to the other side just like this and make it goes inside the portal i really recommend you to make it like a bit above the portal so you don't get stuck and scale to the other side after you've done that you can place a seat right in the back make sure your rotation is on 90 degrees and then rotate twice place it at the back and come over here rotate twice and tilt it three times and place it somewhere like there and i'm going to move the place of this portal i'm going to place it Somewhere like that and we'll color it red after you do that select this part anchor it and now you can remove the ladders save again and you're done that's the grinder so now I'll show you how to set it up you first of all sit in here take a cake place it at the back right there and you can remove the seat and this block move to that seat sit in it and after you sit anchor it by placing a block under it or maybe a pole just like that and now you can remove these and reset character make sure your spawn funnel covers the whole spawn my one is a bit bigger than expected but it works make sure it covers every single spawn so my one is good and it doesn't have trees in the way so after you do that place a jetpack and fly upward and place a seat right in the middle facing that way place a cake at the back right there you can remove the seat and the block and sit in this one after you do that you can anchor it by placing a block and now you can remove these and i'm going to free myself by closing off this and closing it on again after that place a portal color it the same color of the end portal which mine was red get a jetpack and go inside after you're here press this button it's going to go down and then you can anchor this after anchoring it make sure you disconnect this from the main grinder now you can go back and start making the conveyor cell so for the conveyors i have a full video the link will be down in the description i'm just going to go with the raster version because i really like it just try to connect it with the grinder itself and the spawn panel. So now if we test it out, it should work. I'm going to take a screenshot and send it to the Discord. If you want to join my Discord server, the link will be down in the description. You can join it. So as you guys see, I just passed the portal. This portal because the conveyor is very fast. 
don't worry, don't make a conveyor as fast as mine, cause like, don't be stupid like me. I can reset character and let's try it again. As you guys can see, I'm right here and I got the treasure. Also make sure you move this, like if it's like that, just move it a bit to the, like upward. That the part that is showing on the screen, just move it a bit upward and that's that will fix it. And yeah, that's the normal setup with the gold block. Uh, it's on, it's breakable as you guys can see. Like some of these, as you see, is breakable. And now I'm going to show you the unbreakable version. Okay, so for the unbreakable version, which is the underground version, you have to join one of the two teams, which is yellow and magenta. So I joined yellow, you just load it back. Okay, so it loaded. First of all, do the spawn funnel, just like the previous version. So you just sit in here, place a cake, and take it to the seat right there. You place a block, you can remove these and reset character. Also, before you reset character, if you if you get stuck like in this in this area, you can just close it by placing some blocks like this and make sure it's very close to the portal. Like something like that. Now let's do the grinder. Just do like just like the previous version, we're going to fly up to here. So place a cake and take it like this. You can remove the platform, it's no longer needed. Take it to the edge. If you're on the yellow team, take it to this edge. If you're on the magenta team, there will be an edge right there. You take it to the edge that is close to the stages. And now you have to place a seat. Rotate it, make sure it's looking that way and then tilt it. Make sure it's looking at the ground that way. So you can place it, place it somewhere, place it somewhere very close to the water. And now you can sit on it just like that. And let me just anchor it so it doesn't fall. You can remove the seat and the cake. And here we have to place four pistons. Tilt them twice and place four of them on top of each other. Make sure the fourth one is on nine or eight. After you do that, place an anchor block on top of it. Place it right there. Now you can remove this thing and then just turn them off. Now after you got it under the ground, come to this portal and enter it just to make sure it's not inside a rock. Let me just go inside. And as you guys can see, it's not under the rock. Some people have their like stuck on dirt, like under a rock. That's not good. Just move it away. Like after you check that, it's time for the conveyors. You have to make two conveyors. One for this one looking forward and one for that one looking through the water. A place a block and make a simple conveyor glitch. So to do that, make sure the seat is not connected to that thing. And you just remove this, select this and do a normal conveyor. And make sure you test it and it works. Now it's time for the conveyor for that part. So just do another conveyor with the same things. But this time it's going to be looking that way. And make sure you anchor it before it touches the wall. So you just sit look upward and then anchor it before it touches the wall okay so just scale it and make it touch the grinder itself not the glow block the grinder you have to take it from under the ground and make it touch the grinder and now you can reset character and let's, it, let's test it out so as you guys can see it's a working grinder i really recommend you to use an auto reset script i have a video the link will be down in the description because there is a state that can block this grinder i don't think it's currently loaded but there is a stage that can stop this also at the end i just that at the end you get stuck on here you can remove it if you don't want to use a script but if you're using a secret then you just keep it right like that also you don't get full gold but it's better than nothing okay so that is for this video if you enjoyed Please hit the subscribe button. Also comment down below if this was easy or not. Let me know what you think. Also, if you have any problem with the grinder, you can ask me in the comments below. So that is for this video. If you enjoyed, hit the like button. See you in the next video.